Hello everyone, we are Juan David and, and Laura Valentina and we are going to talk about the South Korean and Colombia differences specifically between their dress and appearance It is interesting to find all the difference that these two cultures have They are different people and in many if not in all ways Now let's start Colombian people don't see clothing as the main thing, so that's why they dress as they can. For this reason, Colombian people have a lot of looks, and even though they look generally like normal people with their fashionable clothes or the ones that they are wearing at the moment, there are some traditional and representative clothes that makes the difference between the usual clothes and the traditional ones. Now, we will realize that Colombian traditional clothing is distinguished according to regions. The traditional dress of the man is long white or black pants, a shirt accompanied by a red scarf around the neck, espadrilles, hat and a carrier or leather bag. The woman wears a long flowered skirt and a long sleeved white blouse with a high neck or sometimes with lace, which is combined with a braided hairstyle on the shoulder. Also, the characteristic garments are the rana, a style of poncho woven in wool, and the paisa hat which is usually white and has a black strip that borders the cup. A walk down almost any street in Korea will reveal that today's Korean wardrobe ranks from jeans and casual fashions to tailored suits and chic designer creations. However, of all the outfits one is likely to see, the most striking is without a doubt the hanbok. The traditional costume worn by Koreans of all age particularly on traditional holidays and when attending social affairs with a traditional The women's handbook consists of a ward around skirt and a jacket It is often called Chima Yogori Chima being the Korean word for skirt and Yogori the word for the jacket The men's handbook consists of a short jacket and pants called baji that is roomy and bound at the ankles. Both ensembles may be topped by a long coat of a similar coat called durumaji, kinds of handbook. Apart from the handbook that we already show, which we can say is the basic or the main one, There are also other types of, of handbooks and typical clothes. The version corresponds to a pair of contemporary socks, although the shape of the version does not reflect any difference in the gender of its users. Men's version is characterized by a straight seam. Doll handbook. The first birthday of a child, the doll, is traditionally celebrated with wishes of longevity and health. Children wear the doll handbook for doll odd on this special day. A boy usually wears a pinkish jewelry jacket with a long blue gorium cloth strings. Girls usually wear rainbow strip Jogori for special occasions. Currently, the trend is for girls to wear a dangi, a kind of ceremonial coat. Holy book, wedding handbook. Unlike handbooks for daily use, handbooks worn as a traditional wedding custom are made by their bright appearance. The bridegroom wears the baji pants the yogori, a jacket, the gogi, a vest, the magoha, an overcoat, and the durumagi, an overall coat. The bride wears a green shima, a skirt, a yellow yogori, a short jacket, 
and a onesan, a bright long overcoat. Her hair is prepared using a yogduri, a special head ornament. Additionally, the red circles on the forehead and cheeks were called yongi and gongi. They work to warn of evil spirits and give purity and love to the bride. And now we are going to talk about what are Colombian people like. Charming cultural quirks and distinctive ways of speaking make them so unique. Colombian people are joyful and optimistic. Being one of the happiest countries, the people of Colombia are filled with positivity and hope. As a big family, they usually come together, always having a helpful hand for the one who needs it. Colombian people are creative. They are always looking for new ways to improve their lifestyle, innovate and find new paths. Very cultural and full of diversity in every street that you can visit. Resilient people. This word defines Colombians like no other. The way people, communities, institutions and companies adapt and grow or usually survive despite the social and economic problems or challenges that they often face. Despite their history full of violence, the narco state and the lives of individuals like Pablo Escobar, Colombians are proud to look back and know that even the struggle continues, they will achieve and beat to lead their country to become a better one. What are South Korean people like? We already talked about South Korean clothing. Now it's time to show you the traits that represent South Korean people. The first thing that we should know about them is the fact that they hate is disgusting and uncomfortable to them when people from another country call them chinos even more when people know they are not chinese and still treat them like that they are people who in one way or another like to live together so usually in large buildings people who like company and strong flavors Pretty clean people who have made their organized life a very healthy routine. People are a little more respectful, inclusive and friendly in an extroverted way, because regarding the intimidate they are usually very close. The love of a couple has a very strong magnitude because it is seen as a great union. People from children are very well educated both academically for their personal life now and in adult life. A mother place makes mother people. They are people who usually follow all superstitions, not so expressive but full of good energy. Koreans are very clear about the desire to follow constant and changing beauty standards, very neat and concerned about their personal image. And that's all. Thanks for watching and we hope you like our video.